Those that say, you know, I pray in my heart. I'm not one of those tyrants, I'm a good person. So we know in our deen that salah is the distinguishing factor between the believer and the disbeliever. And it's the ultimate decider of what your day of judgment is going to be like. But what is the connection between those horrible men and salah? And the answer is they forgot Allah. And when they forgot Allah, they became arrogant. So they didn't recognize his blessings upon them, nor the truth that he sent to them. So they never prayed and they died in their pride. The first person called for hisab in the hadith is similar in that they didn't use their blessings to propel them to worship. And so Allah forgot them just as they forgot Allah. Now, it's not that you can ever really repay Allah with your prayers, right? I mean, you can never repay Allah, period, for his blessings. The Prophet, he mentioned to us some.